what is up everybody and welcome back to our channel my name is grace square and you are tuned into our try it thursday series so i have a special guest with me here today do you want to introduce yourself say hi 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 this is my daughter olivia and we're kind of matching today kind of matching because we want to try to take mother's day pictures with a DIY backdrop that I will use on an app. Um, this is my official Mother's Day. Look at my necklace, it says Mama. Shout out to the besties for that. Yes. And so we take a couple of pictures already. And so my husband's gonna help me with the rest because it's always good to have someone behind the lens that Olivia can focus her attention on. Right, Livy? <laughs> Yeah, so let's see if we can pull off this Mother's Day look. Do you think we can? Yes? All right, if you guys are interested to see how Livy and I take our first Mother's Day photos together, stay tuned. Say bye. So the first thing that I did was take pictures. At first I had the camera on the tripod, but that really wasn't working. So um, my husband got the camera and started taking pictures and made Libby smile because these are the before. She just wasn't feeling it. What about this one? So yeah. So after I decided which picture to use, I opened up the PixArt app and this is the picture I chose. So then I chose to do the cut out um, tool and that's basically just cutting out the picture. As you can see around my head and Olivia's head, you can still see the wall and like i tried to not take the picture oh where did libby's face go i tried not to take the picture like directly in front of a wall and kind of more in free space so it would be easier to cut out and this is the most tedious part of this diy um backdrop but once you get the picture like perfectly cut out and it doesn't have to be 100 percent perfect it will be worth it. I'm so happy how this picture came out. So yeah, I'm just trimming around everything and erasing all the wall from the background. So at this point, I am satisfied with my image. So then I select um, to crop it and I selected the rose backdrop. Um, you can go on Pinterest and find all kinds of backdrops. So I decided to add that image um, on my camera roll and use that as the backdrop. And I would just place Livy and I where I want us to be. And then I blur out the background just a little bit so Livy and I can pop out. So this is the final picture. I just love it so much. I just posted it on my Facebook. 
and I am so happy. We hope you enjoyed our video and I think the picture came out super cute. What do you think, Livy? Tell them, what do you think? You tell me you thought it was beautiful. So if you guys get a chance, it's super easy to try. Um, I know we're all in quarantine and it's hard to take Mother's Day pictures, but that's my Mother's Day hack. Say bye. I'll give you one. Later. How did you feel about your Mother's Day pictures? What? Olivia say, give this video a thumbs up and I'll appear more on more videos, huh? <laughs> Uh-oh. All right, we might really have to log off, right, Olivia? Because your song's about to come on? Uh-oh. What is this? <laughs> yes. Get it. Yes. Baby shark. Well, let's go before we get copyrighted.